Hello, hello everybody. And welcome back to day two of Honkai Impact, except it's actually day three because I did skip a day of recording. Don't worry, you didn't miss anything. I just did some farming and stuff. What are you showing me here? Uh, don't know how I raised a character's affection, but sure. Uh, what else? What else? Ah, yes, I did get her share of the void. Haven't touched her at all yet. What's this? Okay, why are you telling me about this? I can't do anything. But, huh. Why are you telling me about something completely unrelated? Is this... do I have a better weapon I could give her? Apparently not. No, I'm probably not even going to use her right now because, well, if only for story immersion. Uh, let's do some quick work on the rest of my characters, though. I really wish these weren't so horny. <laughs> oh yes, and at time of recording this, I still haven't actually uploaded the first video yet. So whatever comments you guys might have left on that, I haven't seen them yet because they don't exist yet. Oh, I can't do any more stigmata work. Uh, skills. Oh, quick level up. Oh yeah, and I did also do the, um, trial thing for... Uh, Mobius's new outfit and just god I wish I had Mobius <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna get her though I think the banner goes away in like two days a shame she's so cool okay I think that's everything I can do for Bronya May your turn I should really go through and like properly read what all of these things do, but oh my god, there's a lot of them. Ow, okay. Uh, that seems to be everything for me. Kiana's turn.
And that's about everything I can do for Kiana, too. Alright then, let's continue. Wait, what's this? Oh, battle pass stuff. Okay then. Wait. Oh, I thought it leveled up. Um, now what are you showing me here? I guess this. I got an outfit for a character I don't have. By the way, how is her name actually pronounced? I thought it was like Seal, but I've also heard like Zela or something like that. Please let me know. <laughs> now what are you showing me here? More coins. Is that it? Oh, this is so cute. Now what? My God. I'm getting so much stuff. The new player experience. Oh, that reminds me actually, before we keep going, um... Oh, I want you so bad. Yeah, it ends in like two days. Absolutely no way am I getting her. Oh, part of Felis. Um, anyways, yes, I have enough to do a ten pull on the beginner's banner. So I suppose I should do that? Huh. S rank Valkyrie guaranteed in 100 drops. So you get 100 pulls on the newbie banner? Interesting. New S-rank Valkyrie guaranteed in three S-rank drops. And the top guaranteed one is 100% guaranteed to be new. Huh. Okay, I slip. I might as well. It's discounted. it is. Yes. Uh, ooh, she's a healer. I'll mess around with her later. Okay, enough messing around. I'll do all of that later. Let's let's just keep going with the story. Also, I decided yes, I am going to read things aloud, but no, I am not going to voice act them because that takes a lot out of me.
Hello? Testing. The exam is about to start. Combat trials will be single round competitions. All Valkyries will be divided into pairs. The graders will rate you according to your performance. Winning is not everything, Valkyries. Candidates and graders, please take your positions. What? Kiana, you look terrible. Were you stealing food from the fridge without microwaving them? <laughs> is that something she does? I've been having terrible dreams for the last two days. I can't remember the details, but it's terrible, May. You were leaving me in the dreams. <sighs> it's alright, Kiana. It's just a dream. I think exam stress has gotten into you. I'll be here always. I'll make you a great meal after this. Really? <laughs> Please go easy on me in the exam, May. Eh? No, that would be cheating. Put on your battle suit. It's time to get serious. May, you're so heartless today. Okay, let me switch back to Kiana. Kiana, you did way better than I expected. It's because I'm up against you, May. I've been waiting for a chance to show off my skills to you, May. Aww. That's why you get to see me at 200% performance today. Bronya did not expect to meet subject Kiana the idiot in this round. Bronya, are you alright? I'm actually pretty glad to see you recover. Mm. Subject Kiana is attempting a sympathy attack against Bronya. <laughs> Negative. Subject Kiana is too stupid to use such tactics. <laughs> so mean. I'm glad because it's time to wallop you fair and square, you pesky little brat. <laughs> I'll let you know that my powers are way beyond your scope of imagination. Bronya has no fear. Bronya shall counter the Neanderthal. <laughs> Subject Kiana's mental capacities are overtaxed by the Honkai. Bronya shall show no mercy. I'll show no mercy either. Ally Bronya deployed. <laughs> How's that, Bronya? You're no match for me when I'm at 200% performance. Combat performance subpar. Bronya was too optimistic. Physios have yet to recover. Do not gloat, Subject Kiana. Bronya has scanned the score lists. Subject Kiana will be fighting the class monitor next. Ooh, fuhua! <laughs> what? You gotta be kidding me! Greetings, Kiana. I'm pleased to have you as an adversary. F fu fu What is it, Kiana? Something you want to talk about? Ugh. True intents are hidden behind the skin. But release your mental burdens and direct your focus to the fight ahead. Distractions will only keep you from victory. In truth, I have always admired you, Kiana. Your energetic spirit and optimism are inspiring. You are an outstanding Valkyrie, Kiana. 
I am pleased to spar with you in honorable combat. I got it. I don't care if I win or not. I'll give it my best. But Fuhua, you talk like an adult. <laughs> We're just high school girls. The way you talk is kind of weird. <laughs> See, I know things about Fuhua. Hmm, <laughs> indeed. The fight is about to commence. Ready yourself, Kiana. Oh, ah, that's interesting that May is the one getting the up versus Fuhua. Most impressive, Kiana. I don't know if that actually is supposed to indicate anything lore-wise. I'm surprised myself. I'm like running at 1000% performance today. I feel so uber today. Alright. I have so much stamina. My god. We're gonna be here for a while, I think. Hello. Before recess break begins, I'd like to introduce Rita Rossweiss, our auditor from HQ. She's here at St. Freya to see what we're doing for the Valkyrie exams, so do your best, girls. Wow, she looks so pretty and gentle. Is she really a Valkyrie? Excuse me, Madam Teresa, your students are an impressive lot. I feel like sharing a few moves with them myself. Ooh, are we gonna get to try out Rita? Sharing a few moves? Several Valkyries performed admirably. I'd like to ask if I can spar with one of them. Ooh, are we gonna get to fight Rita? Um, okay, let's welcome Miss Rita. She'll show us a few combat moves. Who will be our lucky student? Who is that silver-haired girl? Um, Kiana Kozlana. Kiana? Why her? Oh, a Kozlana. Oh no, not that Kozlana. She's not related to them at all. She's not? Not related to who? Hmm? What? Spar with an HQ official? What will the fight be about? Oh, I'm tapping the wrong buttons. Uh -huh. Why is Rita scoring higher than me? No, that's not allowed. Oh, do I have to use Kiana to increase the score? Or what is happening? That was bad. That will be all. Good job, Kiana. Is that like a scripted loss? <laughs> I'm not done yet. I can keep going. But you look so exhausted. I'll take my leave. This is the final round. Candidates, please put on the sync device once your name is called. The simulated combat program will select a suitable module as your opponent. Do your best, girls. Kiana Kozlana, prepare sync. Access 98.6%. Sync ratio 100%, generating adversary modules. Sync ratio 120%. What? System error, obviously. What happened? What's going on? Himeko, what's happening? 
Something's wrong. The program should initiate auto-exit upon an error report. Program sync ratio is stuck at 120%. This means... Force closing the program may be unwise. Adversary module generated. <laughs> it's Ganesha! Impossible! Our database shouldn't be generating an em Emperor class Honkai Beast module. Don't worry about shutting things down. I'll just mop the floor with this thing. <laughs> Will you now, Kiana? I have some doubts about that. Kiana, are you alright? Now that's a tiring fight, but I can easily have these enemies for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Alright, Kiana, go back to rest. An exciting battle. The opponent is a simulated module, but it's an Emperor class Honkai beast. I'm really looking forward to her future performance. What a surprise, little one. You managed to defeat Ganesha. You should know that this Honkai beast first appeared at India in 2020... Blah, in 2012. It killed two A-rank Valkyries and severely wounded 12 others. I thought a B-rank Valkyrie like you would never survive this. Who is talking? Pfft. Despite being a B-rank Valkyrie, I have the powers of an S-rank powerhouse. What a braggart. You're pretty good, I'll give you that, but you're still far from being an S-rank Valkyrie. I fought an actual S-rank Valkyrie 14 years ago. Oh, is this... Hersher of the Void? No, she doesn't talk like that. Who is that? 14 years ago? You fought an S-rank Valkyrie? Wait, aren't you that... Oh, so it is her. Hey! You're the second Hersher! Impossible. I thought they nuked you 14 years ago. Why are you in my dreams? Ha! Huh, your idiocy can be super cute at times. I really want to take a bite out of you. <laughs> this might be a dream. But you're not getting out of here alive today. You killed my mom. I never expected to leave this place. You know why? Your dreams are my dreams. I am you, and you are me. The one to leave should be you, Kiana. Shut up! Tower of Babylon Experimental Group Code Experiment Subject K423. Oh, there she is. Um, let's see the real world. Why can't you, like, move the camera? I can't see. <laughs> what? Uh, hmm, that's frightening. Do I have to... Yeah, I have to fight you.
Whoa. I said this before, but a lot of this stuff is happening, like, way earlier than I thought it would. Why is it fading out? This is a purchase thing. How do I... Oh, there. There's an X. Stop trying to make me buy things. Oh, wait. I... have stuff to pick up here. I have to download more stuff. Extremely rude. Suggested level 20. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's throw some levels at them real quick. Just enough to get them to the recommended level. I think from now on I'm gonna, like, do most of my leveling off-screen, though. Just cause there's a lot of it to do, at least in the beginning here. Everything got back to normal when the Valkyrie examinations ended. New missions were set according to the message left. Valkyrie started the search for the four gems. Are you going to explain what that is? 
first destination is New Zealand. New Zealand under order of the Shiksal. The gem of desire awaits them there. Second Lieutenant Kiana, I see you've arrived at New Zealand. Prepare for mission briefing. Wait, Himeko, can you tell me about the analysis of that unmanned battleship? Mission briefing takes priority, Kiana. Bad news first. A powerful Honkai spike was detected in New Zealand one day ago. The place is now crawling with zombies and Honkai beasts. The Oceania branch is out of action. The Gem of Desire went miss missing during the incident. The good news, the Hyperion is furnished with a sensor capable of locating the gem. Find it and bring it back. Himeko, what exactly is the Gem of Desire? Yes, please explain. Shiksal got a hold of three powerful Honkai cubes 14 years ago, one of which was the Gem of Desire. A covert research program was started three years ago to use this gem and develop weapons capable of fighting a Hersher. The research program failed. The gem was kept in the Oceania branch ever since. That's all I know. Alrighty, let's go get that gem. Kiana-chan, Himeko told me that you're curious about the battleship. I'll tell you the analysis results. I'm Terry V. You're the world's number one cutie. What did you just say? Never mind. Analysis showed that the battleship was not fully activated. Only one of the 24 anti-grav drives were operational. Weapons systems were frozen as well. The fully activated battleship would have leveled North America within 24 hours. For the sake of comparison, the Hyperion's Honkai reactor has a max output of... Um, I couldn't read that. The Selene has almost 10 times that number. Wow, the most powerful reactor of Shiksal has, a, has an output of 1,500. There's only one way to build a reactor with an output that exceeds 1,500... whatever that is. You're talking about Hershers? Correct. In the Nagazora incident, the third Hersher delivered a hit amounting to 3,200 against the Hyperion. To fully activate that battleship, you would need the powers of four Hershers. Wow. The voice mentioned four keys. Principal, where did the Gem of Desire come from? I can't find related data from the archives, even those related to A-rank Valkyries. Curiosity killed the cat. Do you still want to know, Major? Of course. My girls are fighting down there for that stupid rock. I need the truth. I'll tell you about it. It happened 14 years ago. That's when the four gems, including the Gem of Desire, appeared. The thing 14 years ago? So it's related to the second Hersher? Yes. The second Hersher dragged Siberia into an imaginary space 14 years ago. Five of our A-rank Valkyries were killed in battle. Even Cecilia, our S-rank Valkyrie, could not defeat her. But we did win, eventually. How did that happen? What has that got to do with the Gem of Desire? Thirty minutes after the battle against the second Hersher started, Cecilia was the only one left standing. I plan to put on my battlesuit and fight along her side, but Grandpa Otto stopped me. Grandpa Otto? Overseer Otto Apocalypse? When am I gonna get to meet him? <laughs> he thought I won't do any good. He ordered me to unleash Honkai Fit 
fissile missiles to attack the second Hersher. Honkai fissile missiles? Those things could kill hundreds of Honkai chariots, but leaves the region, region contaminated. They didn't do anything to the second Hersher. She moved them to the imaginary space before they exploded. But Cecilia grasped the chance. She sacrificed herself to destroy the core of the second Hersher. Her core fractured into four gems. I guess the Gem of Desire was part of the second Hersher's core. Exactly. But there was an accident when we recovered the gems. My troops found the second Hersher's core fractured into four pieces when they went to recover her body. That was when they appeared, with more advanced battleships and tactical mechas. That was our first encounter with Anti-Entropy and the first Hersher who led them. The second Hersher was their aim as well. But Shixal kept the Gem of Desire. I thought Anti-Entropy would have taken it. Otto managed to deceive them. Shixal's Valkyrie forces were devastated. We had no chance against Anti-Entropy. Luckily, Anti-Entropy had, had no idea that the second Hersher's core was broken into four pieces. We fooled them, we gave them her corpse and one of the gem fractures. We told them that's all we got, and they bought it. This is the place indicated by the sensor, but I don't see anything. Perhaps the sensor's malfunctioned. Nay, wait. What's the matter, Bronya? Biosensors detect vital readings 50 meters to the east. East. I see it. There's a girl on a, in a wheelchair. This place is dangerous. We should save her. Target located. Target? But I thought we're looking for the Gem of Desire. We only found this girl. Intel from Oceania Branch confirmed the girl as the Gem of Desire. Oh, Wendy! Zombies and Honkai beasts? Not the toughest enemies around, but don't let your guard down. Allow me to explain. Three years ago, the Oceania Branch implanted the Gem of Desire into Wendy's calf. Huh. The aim was to meld the gem with her tibia to achieve her sure grade powers. Haha, <laughs> well given- I know like one thing about Wendy, and it's that she's the Hersher of wind. <laughs> I guess this Wendy should be pretty powerful, but she's a girl in a wheelchair. Wendy was Oceania's best, best Valkyrie. She might have become the fourth s rank Valkyrie of this generation, but she still couldn't handle the gem's power. I wasn't strong enough to contain the power of the gem. I lost control of my legs. They should have taken out the gem. Wendy shouldn't be stuck in this wheelchair. The gem of desire is extremely unstable in every medium, but it stabilized in Wendy's body. So Shiksal decided to use Wendy's body as a vessel for holding the gem? That's evil. No point arguing this here. Bring Wendy back to the Hyperion. We're heading back? But I'm in a wheelchair. I might slow you down. I can't believe it. Bronya does not believe Wendy will slow us down. Project Bunny, activate! <laughs> a robot? It just materialized from thin air. Project Bunny, pick up Subject Wendy. Zaychik will carry you. Subject Wendy? What? It can fly! Awesome! Bronya, can I ride on your robot next time? <laughs> For Subject Kiana? Nyeh. Oh, you're not who I meant to switch to? Ah, oh my god, I keep switching to the wrong characters.
We will be back on the battleship in four minutes. Statement proven. Wendy did not slow down the squad. Bronya is so kind today. I guess the mighty Bronya's data center is corrupted by the kindness virus. <laughs> Thank you, Bronya. Bronya is glad to help. Bronya is equipped with armored leg prosthetics. Bronya was wounded and confined to a wheelchair after an experiment. The exoskeleton system restored Bronya's ability to walk. Aww. Awesome! Does that mean Wendy can recover one day? I'll be able to walk and fly like Bronya, right? Da. Bronya believes it is possible. Oh, that's sweet. Once we return to St. Freya High, the gem can be removed. Subject Wendy shall regain the ability to walk. You're so nice, Bronya. I'm getting the hang of the combat. Bronya, what is it? I'm surprised to see you submit a personal request. Major Himeko, Bronya requests St. Freya High to remove the gem from Wendy. The removal will restore her walking abilities. That's not possible. We need Wendy to keep the gem stable. We can't keep the gem if it's taken out. Just throw that stupid gem away! The rock means nothing compared to a girl's happiness! The Gem of Desire is no ordinary rock. It contains enough Honkai to vaporize several cities, and that's what will happen if it goes off. But... It's alright, Kiana. I've accepted my fate. Valkyries must sacrifice themselves for the greater good. It's my duty. Oh, crap. I do not get tired of that slow-mo at the end. ウェンディ、ごめんなさい。うん。ペロニアが何も悪くない。崩壊エネルギー反応検出。ウェンディの体内にある。デザイア<笑><笑> これくらいあれば<笑> 
Just noticed things are going bad, so she retreated. <laughs> All right, fair enough. <laughs> Give me all of this stuff. Wendy has flown away. Report this to HQ. Dispatch a tri bleh. Dispatch S rank Valkyries to capture her. Bronya does not think Wendy will hurt anyone. We can't afford the risks. She has Hersher powers. Her mind and ego might have been corrupted by the Honkai. I trust Wendy too. Back in Nagazora, Mei was also controlled by the Honkai, but she managed to resist it. Kiana's right. We can restore Wendy if we help her. I'll report this to HQ. The S rank Valkyrie will be here in 30 minutes. You hear that? You have 30 minutes to do whatever that needs to be done. Thank you, Major Himeko. Two bad news. First, HQ has tagged Wendy as the fourth Hersher. Second, the S rank Valkyrie from the European HQ has been deployed to bring her in. S rank Valkyrie? Ha! I would have loved to spar with them in school. But this is definitely not the time to meet them. They've deployed S rank Valkyrie Durandal. Oh. She's clad in black armor and wields a massive lance. Word is that she's the most powerful S-rank Valkyrie we have. 
Alright, let's see if we can't track down Wendy before Durndal shows up then. Another bad news. Shiksal satellites picked up five aerial battleships flying across the Pacific. Exact location unknown. Aerial battleships? Could that be anti-entropy? Who else? Alright girls, give up your search if you run into anti-entropy. I'm not losing any of you on this chase. Kiana-chan, let me give you a hand this time. Anti-entropy is on the move? Sounds like a great opportunity to me. <laughs> give me a hand? What do you mean, Aunt Terry? You'll know soon enough. Uh. <laughs> wow. Okay, somehow I don't think this is where I'm supposed to be going. Or maybe it is. <laughs> Found Wendy? We're out of time. The S-Rank Valkyrie will arrive in New Zealand in two minutes and anti-entropy battleships are coming too. Damn it, are we running out of time? Don't worry about the S-Rank Valkyrie or anti-entropy. Did you manage to stall the S-Rank Valkyrie? No, I can't do that, but I know where she is. Could that mean... what? That's right, I aired the S-Rank's position on a public channel. I'm sure anti-entropy intercepted my message. Oh my god, Teresa. They probably went off course to intercept the Valkyrie. So that's what the explosions are. Oh my god, Teresa. Selling out one of our own doesn't feel good, but she'll be doing okay. I hope anti-entropy gave us more time. All right, it's our turn now. Found you, Wendy. Why follow me? Do you seek death? I've spared you out of my kindness. You have no idea who you are dealing with. Wendy, please come back with us. It's dangerous here. Shiksal deployed an S-rank Valkyrie to capture you. Anti-entropy is coming too. S-rank Valkyrie? Those with Hersher level powers? I really want to know if I can take on an S-rank myself. Hey, that's so arrogant. You'll have to get through me first. I was just careless. Even Hershers are no match to me if I get serious. I won't upset Bronya nor fight you. Stop following me. She flew away again. I just talked to Durandal, and I got her coordinates. Talk about gullible, huh? I guess I can give her a star for honesty. Can't help it, we must give Kiana and the girls more time. But exposing her location to the enemy? Durandal is supposed to be an ally. Ally? That nagging little brat is definitely no ally of mine. She gave me a really hard time back then. I'll have to deal with the anti-entropy anyway. Durandal can soften them up a bit. But you're giving anti-entropy quite a bit of advantage by telling them where she is. Oh, but Durandal is uber-powered, you know? Terrific. I love you, Aunt Terry. <laughs> 
Stop playing coy and find that Wendy. Now. I was really hoping to meet an S-rank Valkyrie. You should feel lucky, lazy bones. She'll PT you to Kingdom Come if she was your instructor. PT? I was about to ask about that. What's that? PT stands for physical training, and she's really good at that. Of the three S-rank Valkyries of Shiksal, two were naturally talented. Durandal got hers with hard work. To be on par with the other two Valkyries, Durandal was expected to put in 10 to 20 times the effort. But the truth was that she put in 100 times the effort. Maybe she was super untalented. Did it work for her? She thinks it did. She now believes that hard work can solve everything. If she knew you flunked your theory test, she'll force you to study 26 hours a day. She'll get you through hundreds of practice questions. You can forget about sleeping. She sounds like an evil witch. Textbooks are written by the most boring people on earth. Oh, not what I meant to do, but sure. Oh, do you or Aunt Terry know that S-Rank Valkyrie? Oh, I don't know her very well, but I trained her for a while after she became an A-Rank Valkyrie. A subordinate and her direct superior? Then you two should be close. Hmm, really? But things didn't turn out that way. The way you said it, I'm sure something weird happened between you two. Nothing weird happened between us two. I told you that she's serious and believes in hard work, right? Yeah. She had the nerve to think that superior officers should be serious and believe in hard work, too. Every time I tried to take a little break, she'd lecture me on and on. Gosh, I guess I should be thankful that Himeko is a slacker and deadbeat drunk. Hey, Kiana, stop thinking out loud. <laughs> anyway, I found a way to get her off my heels. A way? What way? That's a secret but it has to do with the keyword Roland. Once she opens her trap, I'd say the word Roland to shut her up. <laughs> I see. Orlando Furioso jokes. in trouble. What's wrong, Teresa? Durandal messaged me. She sent anti-entropy packing. I guess S-rank Valkyries are indeed powerful. She asked me about the anti-entropy ambush since I'm the only one who knew her location. Let's walk away with the lesson that lying is wrong. <laughs> Think of something smart to say, quick, or else. Or else? Or else... She might not report this, but she'll be here and, and nag to us for a day. Oh, I'll avoid your office when she comes by then. <laughs> hey, he make oh, I'm not leaving you out of this. <sighs> I thought of one, Principal. Tell her there's an anti-entropy mole in Shiksal. We can't do that. It'll create a huge mess in the Shiksal. 
Bronya thinks we should tell her what anti-entropy initiated this Honkai incident to lure and ambush an S-rank Valkyrie. She was marked from the start. Bronya thinks this will work. Good, but the logical flaw is that anti-entropy would have sent better troops if that's their aim from the start. Hey, listen to my brilliant idea. I noticed that Durandal took the Gold Coast Ocean front line to get here. We'll tell her that anti-entropy was on holiday and happened to bump into her. That's the dumbest and most idiotic thing I've ever heard of. <laughs> it actually might work. It has zero logical flaws. Let me try this. Wait. How did it go? She's coming to nag us out, right? <laughs> she actually bought it. People say she's honest and frank. If you ask me, I think she's just an idiot. <laughs> I feel Durandal is very a very reasonable person. Perhaps we can be friends. Wait, did you just call someone an idiot? <laughs> Elizabeth Bathory. Okay. Oh, this set is cute. I like this one. You girls don't know when to give up. I'll have to teach you a lesson. Hey, that's my line. Wendy, please trust us. You're not yourself. Honka is misleading you. Wait, Subject Kiana. Bronya wants to talk to Subject Wendy. No, stop! I don't want to talk with you, Bronya. Bronya remembered a younger sister named Seal back in the orphanage. Subject Wendy reminds me of her. Seal was strong and kind, like Subject Wendy. I still don't know if I'm saying that right, but oh well. She was corrupted by Honkai, but she fought hard and got herself back. Ronya endured a lot of pain during the modifications, and still suffers to this day. But there is hope. Bronya understands Subject Wendy's pain. Bronya knows Subject Wendy can overcome this pain. Do not give up. Bronya believes in you. I trust you too, Bronya. All right, I'll give myself another chance. Great, Wendy came back to us. <sighs> that was really close. All right, back to the Hyperion. We're all kick-ass Valkyries. If you get controlled by Honkai again, I'll defeat you in no time. Don't worry, Subject Wendy. Bronya will take you home. Bronya, can I sit on your robot again? Can I? <laughs> No problem. Project Bunny, activate. Bronya, your mats Matushka commands you to remo recover the fourth Hersher. The fourth Hersher is an important test subject. We can't let Shiksalt get hold of her. We must destroy her if we can't get her back. Oh boy. You rebellious little brat. No matter, you can't fight it. By the highest level of of authority. Delay the fourth Hersher if you can't defeat it. Our main forces will be here shortly. By the highest level of authority, Project Bunny, switch to attack mode. Target fourth Hersher. Stop! Bronya, what are you doing? Bronya, why did you attack me? Everything you told me was a lie, was it? No one. There's no one I can trust. And we're fighting Wendy again.
That went by really fast. <笑>彼女を弱らせてあなたたちに感謝せねばならないな。うう。おっと、忘れるところだった。ここにリッチャがもう一人いること。ブローニャ、我が娘よ。第三リッチャを捕獲しなさい。何はい。お母様。メシパ
Me and Bronya are right here, though. <laughs> That's always so funny to me. And it's like, you need to save this character, or find this character, or whatever, and the character is in your team. What? Hi? What are you doing here? I mean, I guess I kind of suspected that all the stuff with Kiana probably also had something to do with anti-entropy, but... Oh my god, stop. Stop hitting me. That's not allowed. Kiana, you knew that Bronya was being controlled, right? Uh, I really don't. Oh, really? Uh, I guess I can't hide this forever. Bronya was controlled before while we were carrying out that mission on the Selene. You didn't report this to protect Bronya. Lying for your friends. Yeah, that's very Kozlana. Reminds me of your idiot dad. <laughs> he used to say that seeing people getting hurt makes his Kozlana blood boil. Then he'd just snap. Yeah, that's how the stupid old man talks. In the end, it's anti-entropy's fault. They made Bronya into this. But does Shiksal stand for justice? Shiksal transformed girls into Valkyries to fight the Honkai, but the girls would suffer Honkai corruption. Valkyries with poor Honkai adaptability will die young. I... I don't know. Justice is often opposed by another form of justice. Anti-entropy has their own objectives as well. I don't see anything wrong with working towards a goal. Kazlana justice is the best justice there is. They will gladly sacrifice themselves to protect others. Don't ever forget that, Kiana. Any findings? Nothing. The HQ building is well guarded. There are troops at every entry. Well, it's ME Corp, after all. This is harder than I thought. Principal, there's something I want to ask you. The news was talking about Raiden Rioma, the CEO of ME Corp. Is he May's dad? Why would anti-entropy imprison May in her father's company? That's true. Never thought you'd watch the news. <laughs> but you should know you can't trust news anyway. Hey, wait, is this top secret or something? It's secret, but not top secret. We got to the bottom of this. Officially, Raiden Rioma was arrested for economic crimes, but he was actually framed by anti-entropy. Shiksal and anti-entropy maintained peace while Raiden Rioma led ME Corp. But Kokolia wrested directorship of ME Corp from him. Kokolia is a radical extremist who'd do anything to undermine us. I bet Kokolia was behind it all. Kokolia? I think I heard this name somewhere. That was the... the uh, person who was controlling Bronya, right? Kiana-chan, watching you fight reminded me of my own Kazlana blood. Kazlana blood? I thought you're from House Apocalypse, Aunt Terry. 
<laughs> what, Himeko didn't tell you? I thought everyone knew. I was grown in a lab. Oh, this isn't a spoiler. Part of my genes came from a legendary Kozlana. <laughs> hey, that makes you my grandma or something, right? <laughs> Nonsense. I'm the world's number one cutie. <laughs> but you said you fought alongside the old man. You should be pretty old, right? Why are you so smart at times like this? <laughs> Oh god. Those loading screens scared me. Hmm, I can't find a way in. We've been sitting outside ME Corp forever. Anti-entropy will eventually find us snooping around. Let's retreat for now. No way! I can't give up like this. I'm not heading back. I'll go in alone and rescue Mei. Kiana, being hot-headed won't solve anything. Calm down, subject Kiana. Branya! Never mind. Since you are all so adamant about this, Count me in and let's do it then. Emmy Corp is heavily guarded, but Bronya can bring you in. Awesome! We're trying to do that for ages! Wait, we can't trust her. May was captured because anti-entropy controlled her. Isn't it rather suspicious that she came looking for us now? Trust Bronya, Major Himeko. Bronya wants May to be rescued. Himeko, I don't think Bronya is being controlled right now. I bet Bronya wants to rescue May as well. Alright, since you girls are so adamant about this, what the hell, count me in. Head to access C7 of the building. Alright. Oh, that's a beast. Oh, no, that one is a mech. Stop, Siegfried. Huh? Teresa, who are you calling? Uh, sorry. Just watching you reminds me of the time when I fought alongside your dad. <laughs> you fought alongside the old man? Didn't you already- But, tell me more about him, Aunt Terry. He was a hot-headed maverick who won't follow orders. His tactic is to charge into battle and ask questions later. He's an idiot, too. He can't even remember the activation code of his battleship. <laughs> There are good things about him, though. But I'll tell you when the mission's over. This isn't the best time for chit-chat. Alright, let's hope you remember. Mm. Kiana, didn't you already acknowledge that she had talked about that? Something doesn't feel right. Are you worried about Bronya? It could be a trap. So what? I'm in the team. I won't be stopped by no traps. We'll just smash through the walls if it's a trap. Teresa's so hyped today. She hasn't been doing field work for a while. Teresa used to be a Valkyrie herself. Yes, she was. She was a bit reckless, but she's very, very strong. She was given the S-rank Valkyrie promotion, but she turned it down because... Hey, Himeko, enough with the gossip. All Kiana has to know now is that I kick ass. Let's move on.
撃開始システム警告危険指数上昇Oh my god, there's so many of them. Low Bronya's HP is getting. Oh god, oh god, oh god! Recover HP. These mechs are strong. Valkyries like us could retire if Shiksal could come up with mechs like these. Unfortunately, that's not possible. Shiksal tried develop a, developing autonomous Honkai powered weapons, but it failed. These autonomous units only had a Honkai usage efficiency of 20%. Structural integrity of the units were also corroded by the unstable Honkai energy, and they had to be scrapped after one or two uses. It's just too expensive to use. Shiksal research proved that a Valkyrie's body is the best vessel and converter of Honkai energy. Honkai is only stable within a Valkyrie's body. The only problem is that her body will be continuously corrupted by the Honkai. Her lifespan is greatly reduced. Many Valkyries die young. I know that already, but I don't think anti-entropy is doing the right thing. Despite heavy investments, anti-entropy could only get Honkai usage efficiency to 20% as well. But they simply refuse to use people as Honkai carriers. Perhaps the founders of anti-entropy were more human than the Shiksal leadership. How unfortunate. Bronya, we're at entrance C7 now. Password received XCVF. Verifying gate opened. It's open! Awesome! Be careful when you enter. Bronya is sending you the building prints. May is held in the labs at floor 3. Bronya will be there to open lab doors. Hurry. The researchers are preparing to surgically remove the Herger core from May. I won't let that happen. Don't worry. Let's head to the labs ASAP. May, we're coming for you. Uh, that's mech, so I want 
God, I don't know. There's a bunch of these here at once. Hmm. All right. I was like, why are there so many mechs here? Duh, it's because anti-entropy. Password received. GHDDD. Verifying gates opened. The path to the lab is open. Wait, the gate behind us just closed. This is a trap after all. There's no turning back. I keep hearing Kiana the idiot, but it seems you're pretty vigilant at times. The voice. You're the one controlling Bronya. You must be Cocolia. I am that very Cocolia. You must be Teresa Apocalypse. Didn't expect Shiksal to send a big shot here. Your reputation is as as a, as a great Valkyrie, there precedes you, but I didn't expect you to walk into this obvious trap. People say you're a sly fox, and you are. The bait was too good for us to pass up on. Though walking into a trap isn't exactly ideal, it has made things simpler. We'll just barge our way into the labs, rescue May, and tear down Emmy Corp on our way out. Hmm. <laughs> You sure know how to blow your own horn, girl. You'll find out soon enough. I'll wait for you at the labs. Try not to get killed or I'll be mighty disappointed. Oh, 
Oh my god, that thing is not taking a lot of damage. On getting multiple enemies into the line of Bronya's attacks. <laughs> Is the last one here? Yeah. Give me all of this, thank you. Okay, yeah, the combat in this is really fun. <laughs> Unlocking me. Stop, stop. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Man. Did I already take her down? Yes. Pony is hacked into the processors of some enemy mechs. They will now fight for us. Thank you, Bonya.
Boom. Stop it with the loading screens. I keep thinking I'm about to get disconnected. <laughs> May, wake up! Wake up! Where... where am I? Oh, Kiana! Awesome, you're finally awake! What happened? Bronya, she's down. Bronya, she took a critical injury trying to save you. She's in a coma. It feels like a lot happens that we don't actually get to see in between these little sections. What? How? Damn it. Even the most powerful tech could not enslave our minds. We should get out of here. Pronya's brain may have been damaged, but this is no cause for despair. We'll take her back to St. Freya for treatment. There's a good chance we can cure her. I won't let you girls leave like this. Never mind. I still have the fourth Hersher. I'll just speed the experiment up. Wait, what are you doing to Wendy? I want to talk to Bronya. Wendy, how did you get into this channel? Where are you? We're coming to save you. I know. Bronya's injured. She can't talk right now. I can pass along your message as soon as she wakes up. Back in New Zealand, Bronya only attacked me because she was being controlled. I want her to know that I'll, I've learned the truth. I will not hate her. Never. But I will probably not see her again. And you won't see her again. Why? That's a very concerning statement you've made there, Wendy. Oh wait, that's a Honkai Beast. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Yep, Kiana, get out here. Anya's HP is getting low. Oh, it's not as bad as I thought. Or maybe I picked up some healing items without noticing. It's been a while, Instructor Teresa. We haven't talked since you got transferred to Oceania. I want to know something, but... I know, I was the one who recommended you to the Gem of Desire experiment. You were my... best student. I guessed right. Apologies won't be enough, but sacrifices must be made to save more people. This is why I continue to bear this cross. Instructor Teresa, you look so uncaring, but you're always trying to be strong. Let me thank you for all your guidance. Love the combo attacks you can do, they're so cool. Kiana. Wendy! I don't have much time left. I need to tell you something. The Honkai inside the Gem of Desire allowed me to walk again a few days ago. That energy can help Bronya recover. Of course, you'll need to get the Gem of Desire first. Please. Wendy! Wendy! She's gone. Did Wendy just die? There's no way when Wendy just died, right? Oh, I have to download more stuff. Jun. I don't know who that is, so... Okay, then. Hello there. 
Like my little gift? What gift? Letting Wendy talk to us? I would expect you girls to be grateful. That's Wendy's last words to Bronya. Last words? Oh, I think I forgot to tell you. I've killed the fourth her shirt. <laughs> wow. Okay. But... What? Why? I've taken out the Honkai cube within her, the gem of desire. You can't use the gem even if you want to. Perhaps Shiksal and Nep Shiksal's and Nep tech can't, but I developed the tech to empower a mecha with the gem of desire ages ago. I'd like to thank Shiksal for kindly handing the gem to me. You lunatic! You killed an innocent girl to get a power source! Wendy always wished to exact her vengeance on Shiksal. I merely saw it through. I'm the one who recorded her last message to Bronya. But I guess you can't convey this message now. Try me. Kiana, watch out! Unbelievable. It managed to power this giant mecha. Alright, have fun playing with my newest toy. MSR7 Wotan. I sure hope you can help me provide enough combat data. Take care, girls. Oh, that head looks like an Eva. <laughs> ah! So do these, like, boss enemies just not have, like, alignments or something? Or is this considered... Okay, no, it's not it's something that may counters. Uh, ah. And Kiana doesn't counter it either. Oh god, Kiana's like dying. Kiana, don't die! Okay then, I think I need to uh, beef up my characters before going in there. That said, I have been recording for almost two hours now, so I think I'm gonna call it here. Uh, yeah, I am enjoying this so far, I don't know what else to say. I feel like the pacing's a little weird. Or not really the pacing so much as just like... They don't show a lot. Like it feels like it skips over a lot of stuff, you know? Uh, 
I don't know. Anyways, I'll see you all next time.